Good morning slash afternoon slash evening everybody, I am Southpaw Racer, and this is a super serious track guide to the road course at Gateway Motorsports Park. Tell me, do you fear... Do, do, you, do you feel pain? Do you feel that primal essence of subliminal horror that tears away at you in the background, forcing you to put on a Stepford smile to mask the truth? The feeling that everything is for nothing, th that your life, your dreams, your hopes, and all that matters to you are just a construct? And when you come to that realization, do you somehow feel personally responsible? That the collapse of your security and place in the universe is entirely down to you and your foolish, wandering mind? Gateway feels it. You can see it. Its mouth is open in a cry to the heavens, appealing for meaning for any form of assurance from whatever god may be out there. But god is dead, and this track killed him. Your lap begins on the start-finish straight. Where the fuck else? Driving through turn one is like threading the eye of a needle, but the thread is attached to a Saturn V rocket traveling at escape velocity. If cars coming out of the pits don't... Ah then you're braking right away for another left-hander that has no distinguishing qualities to it, aside from the fact that it's a little faster than you think it is. In anticipation, pick up the throttle too early, get the old off-track 1x, then prepare for a real test of your skills, if your skills are in saintly patience and understeer tolerance. This chicane at least provides a bit of entertainment, where you can engage in a cathartic crushing of dampers and springs. Ugh, I'm so angry at the world. Then a left-hand kink that leads into one of those oh-no-not-again never-ending corners that you will always enter too fast, but by the time you get to the mid-phase of the corner you're going too slow so you give it some throttle, but oh no, that's just resulted in more understeer for turn 7. Such is life, I suppose. The fastest and most efficient way through 6 and 7 is the lost golden city of El Dorado, shrouded in mystery, defined by rumours and inconsistent accounts, has been the subject of many arduous searches, but probably never existed in the first place. All that's missing is a DreamWorks animated movie about it. Swap sides like you're flipping burgers, cause it's time for turn 8, a nondescript, 180 degree constant state corner whose purpose is solely to get you back onto the oval. As with turn two, you will probably get on the throttle too early and get a visit from the understeer fairy, but you are advised to make peace with your problems before you do, because there's a wall waiting for you at the exit instead of grass. Now that you're on the oval again, you have an opportunity to indulge in your late 90s American open wheeler fantasies. Look at me, I'm Tracy, Zanardi, Andretti, and Montoya. With your powers combined, I am Captain Shatcar. Oh, fuck. Oh, oh, oh no. I made this decision. This was all me.